All right, welcome back. I'm Arnold the Box Auditor. Got in a very special package today. It's from Zoe Productions. Um, Zoe Productions and Cabin 13 uh, teamed up and decided to give all us active duty and uh, veterans uh, a lovely gift. Um, it was, from what, I, from what I understand, it was from any members within Zobie, the Zobie community uh, that was a veteran or active duty um, had to reach out to JR <clears throat> and they would get this lovely, this lovely whatever it is. Um, I'm excited uh, and, and you know, being, being active duty, I, I don't expect things for free and, and when, when I get gifts like this, it's not that I feel bad, I just, I, I, I thank you, you know, for your service, it's, it's, it's enough for me. Um, I don't ask for handouts, I even feel bad asking for military discounts at restaurants and stores. You can ask my wife, she's all the time getting on me. But, you know, it's here nor there, it's just one of the many privileges I guess we get as veterans in active duty for the sacrifices we do. Um, and some of the sacrifices, people think, well, what are you sacrificing? It's, it's time away from family. When I hear sacrifice, I think time away from family. And, of course, combat, I mean, yeah, obviously, if we get killed in it, we, we sacrifice. I don't like to think of it like that. But the ones that do perish and, 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 and is not, they're not able to come home, then, yes, they pay the ultimate price. Um, but it's just being away from family, from, from all the Army needs. The Army says it's all about the family, but... Uh, if you're active duty or if you're a veteran, you know it's not all about the family. Uh, I say that lightly, but we all have a job to do in the Army. Um, and, and, and that's what I think when people think, when people say uh, sacrifices. It's being away from my loved ones, my friends, my family. Um, the support that I gain from, from uh, the people, I guess you should say, the, the supporters, um, is more than enough than anything. Like I said, my father did two tours and he came back and they treated him uh, like crap. They spit on him and, and told him how bad they were. Uh, but it's politics when it comes to that kind of stuff. And unfortunately, you know, I'm stuck in the middle. <laughs> uh, but anyway, it's it, it it's an awesome, lovely, lovely uh, gift. Um, I know what it is. But I figured I'd do this video. Get Cabin 13 out there. Them, them, them two are doing such an amazing job. Um, but here we go. Let's get into this. Everybody wants to see it. I want to see it again. Uh, I'm going to bust this thing out. Now this thing here is a Halloween magnet. Check this bad boy out. Let me get my face because y'all don't need to see that. Alright. Look at the size of it. I got small hands. But I make up for others in areas. Anyway, uh, it's huge, um, and looking at it, the, the layers of paint on this, it looks like it was very, very time consuming, and a lot of labor went into it, and of course the resin, you know, um, I, I'm not keen on how they do resin, or anybody does resin, I, I, don't, I don't get it, that's molds, and then you do a mold, and then you cast, there's a lot of work that goes into these, uh, from what it looks like, but this one, it looks like there's like, layer after layer of paint is detailed it's even got the the little things in the pumpkin that that's freaking awesome uh, but also what I like about this magnet is this, it's a flat surface magnet it's a whole body magnet and it's not just some you know magnet that's glued on the back um, that will eventually come off and then you have to glue it back uh, but this thing is a full magnet that's a whole magnet and I think that's pretty neat um, cabin 13 went above and beyond and they, they killed it on this. Uh, I, I am generally, you know, surprised that they would they would send something like this because this is very unique. Um, some people just look at it as a magnet, but I look at the art and the craftsmanship and the hard labor that goes into these things. I'm no artist by no means. I can't play an instrument, but I appreciate people's work. Um, a lot of us have differences and we butt heads a lot, but at the end of the day, we're adults. You know what I mean? Um, and when it comes to art and work, uh, I praise the people who do a good job. Um, and, and Cabin 13, you killed it on this. Good job, fellas. Uh, Cabin 13, you can find them on. Bear with me. 
You can find them on Instagram.com slash underscore cabin13, or you can go on Facebook, uh, www.facebook.com uh, forward slash inner cabin13. Custom busts, keychains, stickers, decals, bandanas, props, sculpts, jewelry, etc. Um, Corey Kaufman is the co owner and designer, and Dale Sylvia is the co owner and sculptor. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna flash their card up here uh, when I'm done editing this. But kudos, thank you, uh, Zobie Productions, and and thank you, uh, Cabin Thirteen. I really appreciate this. Um, Y'all didn't have to do this. Just to, just like I said, a, a thank you for your service would have been enough for me. But anyway, um, don't forget the real heroes are the ones that never come home. Marty the box auditor. Until next time, I'm out.